Hello everyone, welcome again in Angman YouTube channel. So in this video, we will start learn about Python. All right, so in Angman, we will start learning about Python. Okay, so we will do the Python coding using Google Colab. All right, so if you don't have something like Jupyter Notebook, it's, it's fine, it's totally fine because we can do the coding with Google Colab. All right, right now, we are inside the Google Colab. So you can open your browser and then you can go to Google Colab and you can follow me, all right? So this is the window. First thing first, we need to connect to the internet. Click to connect. And we will wait for the allocation, for the connection. And you can see we have code, we have text, all right? All right, we are now connected. So we can type in our code here, like this one. So this is the line for our code. We can delete. All right, and if you want to type in our text, we can open this one at text cell. And we can type in like, let's start doing coding with Python, something like that. All right, so you can see our text is written here. Okay, we can delete. And let's focus on the coding itself. So now this is the line for our coding. So we will start from basic, of course, as usual, we will start from very, very, very basic. And we can go further as far as possible. All right, that's the game plan. So we can do very basic thing like print hello world. All right, this is our first code in Angman and we can press this one. All right, so we can correct it like this one and then rerun. All right, so this is our first code print and hello world we can maximize right you can see and you can follow me of course so this is our first code and we can do simple calculation like this one one plus one run two all right you can do we can add another line for our code we can do with space and we can do without space like this one. One without space plus one. Okay, all right. And then multiplication, one times two. All right. And what about power? So two to the power of two, it should be four. All right, very easy. Two to the power of three, it should be eight. All right. And what about two to the power of 500? We don't know. Okay, All right, very easy. And we can also do another simple calculation like two times two and then plus 100 and then minus four divided by five. All right, it's easy. Okay, I think we can stop here. So again, we will start from very, very, very simple. And in the next video, we can do a little bit more challenging for the coding. All right, so see you again. And thank you so much for watching. Thank you.